Mark it! Look at what it did! It killed everything! The Scott! I thought Corel confiscated the llama thingy. Oh, llama. What did I say? Who gives a flying scut? The gold domes didn't get rid of it, and now the array's fucked. I promise we'll get it fixed soon. Yeah, just like you promised to get your girlfriend to go easy on us? Yeah, okay. Hey, that's not fair. You know what isn't fair, Quill? Being the only one who actually seems to give a scut about the Milano. Look, guys. We need to dock to fix the array. Luckily, I know a guy on nowhere has got the parts we need. And he can get rid of that Nova Trek cheap. No, we cannot abandon the child. The behavior was erratic. The llama thing you chewed the wires, Drax. It was probably just a bad connection. And if we remove the tracker, Corel will make sure the entire Nova Corps fleet is on alert for us. Gamora's right. We made a promise. I made a promise. See if you can pinpoint where Corel is. We pay the fine. Quill, are you freaking kidding me? That way, we don't have to keep looking over our shoulders for Nova on the next job. Yeah, if there is a next job. Sounds like Groot's got that toothy bastard under control. Better not come back here and try to finish chewing through my shift! Or Gamora, did you find... <gasps> Are those... dolls? Yes. No. It doesn't matter. The Halos Hope's in the Teo system. Coordinates are in your console. Okay, Corel, get ready to be impressed. So you surprised me. Once. like your girlfriend held up her end of the bargain, Quill. We know for sure it's her. Checking. Same designation as before. It's definitely Hallis Hope. Ship's fine. Which part? Ask Quill. He's the one who keeps crashing. All right, let's pay that fine. So. What should we do with the leftover money after we pay off the cops? I say we get a landing assist program. There won't be much left, but we should use it to get intel on our next contract. We should use it to acquire food. Yeah. Okay, here we go. If they so much as scratched her paint, we get Novacor to reduce our fine. Good luck with that. It's gross negligent. Negligence. That's what I said. Where is everybody? Most Nova stations are heavily automated, all synchronized by the world mind. It is unsettling. Not like they had much choice after the war. M-ship, 
Designation Milano. Move to holding space R734 PL. Present validated ticket to kiosk prior to. Okay, it's not supposed to be this empty. Is it a holiday? Space cops don't take holidays. Hello? We're here to pay a fine? Looking for Centurion Corral? Door's locked. Well, we tried. Come on, let's go. We're not leaving. We'll go to them if we have to. Look, the door controls are on the other side if we can get you there. So what, now I'm supposed to hack Novacore security? I mean, if you don't think you can... Keep shot, Quilt. We are discussing breaking into a Novacore facility. There, one open air duct. All right, rocket. See if this vent leads into that other room. And be careful. You know, I still don't love this whole pay or fine plan. But I gotta say, messing with some Novacore tech ain't a bad consolation prize. Huh. There's something screwy with the power grid. It's like they're on backup only. I'm sinking the schematic to your visor. Whoa. You could do this the whole time? Follow the circuits and let me know which junctions to switch. We'll have to pick and choose where we reroute power. Watch and learn. That's a door. The wrong door. Hey, hey it's a bathroom. Anybody got to go? The only place I want to go is out of here. We'll find out. This thing's got false positives all over the place. I'll have to do a relay. Is that supposed to mean anything to us? No. I just wanted you to know how... Fucking right, I can't. Anyone want a soda? Nah, I check for you. No faulty in spring water. Hey, that sort of worked. The last door's gonna need some extra juice. See if there's another power button. What the floor, Peter? Sorry, sorry. I'm not much of an electrician. Presto! What out? It's conspicuously silent. Good point. Hey, no! We want to pay our fine and get your Kodrakin oh. tracker off my ship! Hello? Anybody? Oh, poor little guy. It is a thing. Your sympathies Someone are redundant. There. Hey, I'm half thing, remember? Uh, hey there. You are Nova. What gave it away? Hey, jumpsuit. You gotta get me out of here. I don't belong in the cage. Nova Corps begs to differ. Well, no one asked you, scary eyes. We should not be aiding and abetting a criminal. Weren't you a Nova Corps prisoner? Do you know about whatever's going on here? Not much. There was a commotion. People were talking about some mother, and then they just left. Corell? Did you see a Centurion or a little Cree girl? That's all I know. Come on, I helped you. Time to help me. Look for a door release or something. Oh, hey! What did you do? Uh... Hey, where am I going? What's Wonder where it took him. Furnace. Congrats, Quilt. You just executed your first prisoner. That seems improbable. Maybe we just sent him back to his cell. Like, that was the visitor's there. You! Hey, buddy. Ah! Uh, okay. Oh, what now? I got rights! Now this place brings back memories. Did you once serve with the Nova Corps, Peter Quill? Screw it. I ain't making any progress here. I'm getting a real haunted mansion vibe from this place. <laughs> uh, elevator's out. But the shaft above looks open. Oh, crap! Oh. <laughs> okay. Piece of cake. <laughs> Alright, let's hope that holds. 
How come this one gets its own room? Looks like a workshop. You know, I hear they anodize these things with some kind of Zadarian smart metal. Metal cannot be smart. Smarter than some. More nothing! There's gotta be an explanation. You heard that guy. They just left. And so should we. He also said something about Corel. He said mother. Rocket, do your magic. No. What? I said no. When are you gonna come to your senses, Quill? I am Groot. And then what? He's gonna drag us halfway through this station if we let him. Drax, think you could pry the door open? Not without purchase. Perhaps you should negotiate with the rodent. Okay. We try one more room, and if we still haven't found anything, we leave. Deal? Fine. One more room, not two. One. Shifts. I heard they got uh, staffing issues. From who? People. In places with uh, other people. Peter Quill. I found this. Vector 1, check in. Vector 1, sweep complete. 75% acceptance rate. It is as she promised. Have faith. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Well, the good news is we're not alone. There's lots of chatter. Tell them I want my ship back. My ship. I sense there's a butt. But it sounds like they're searching for something or someone. Could explain why no one's around. Well, who gives a flark? Tell them to get their golden butts up here. The promise will be made real. Yeah. Let's keep looking. Or we could focus on getting off this Fracacta space station. The door's flarked, remember? There's ways to unflark things, Gamora. Believe me. Bombs don't count. What about that? Where do you think that goes? Down. Good enough for me. Hey, what happened to one more room? You said the door's busted. I'm sure it's just a little further. You ain't sure a scut. <laughs> There they are. Something's are. not right. Oh, Flark. Dishonor. Flark. I am Groot. <sighs> this is a mutiny. It was an execution. I ain't never seen cops kill each other. We've got to play this smart until we know what's going on. And which side survived? All right. Everyone, stick your love and follow me. There's something off about them. Look. They're flark and glowing. Seems a safe bet these are the bad guys. We need a plan. We should seize the element of surprise. Are we really gonna open fire on Novacor? They don't look like Novacor to me. It is unfortunate they would not accept her promise. They will understand once they are returned. Hold up, Rocket! I did not expect that I would again quarrel with Novacor! Now, Executed his engine! 
us near! More Nova Corps defectors are coming! Oh. I am trying to destroy! Cast on Nova Corps! I think our fine will be paid today. You don't say. Guys, Quill's ship is right there. We just need to... What? What do we need to do, Quill? A whole bunch of whacked out space cops just tried to vaporize us. And you want to go looking for a rematch? Because your, your girlfriend might be in trouble? That's not what I'm doing, and she's not my girlfriend. Could have fooled me. Rocket, the only thing that this is about is getting our ship back. We find Corel, and then none of this is our problem anymore. You're right! It won't be our problem anymore. Because we didn't sign up to be run around halfway across the galaxy by a, a cop love and heal me! I am Groot! Come on! Seriously, Corel? Join the Guardian, she said. It'll be good for your mental health, she said. <sighs> All right. Listen to Flark up. Groot and I are getting off this dast rock. Anyone who'd like a ride can follow us. Everyone else can go to hell! I prefer the rodent's plan. So try. Pursue the non-believers! All must behold her gift! Rocket, come on! And we are! I'm on board! Let's find the Milano the and- Intruders reported in the repair bay! And try not to die in the process. First sensible thing you said all cycle. Intruders in sea junction!
At least. Let's not wait around. Jeez, this is not where I thought this day was going. Hey, you said we needed to go up, right? More up than this. I never thought I'd be fighting Novacore again. They are no longer Novacore. Yeah, this don't count. But who or what are they? We can get through here. <laughs> Yo, Fit, just suck it in. Maybe Corel took her ship back to Xandar to report. <laughs> Look. Are they praying? we wandered into. Check out that big guy. Don't look like no Nova to me. It is a sorcerer. Behold the magic float. Oh, there's no such thing as magic. Right? Come on. Let's get moving before these whack drops spot us. It's like we stumbled on some creepy cult. I told you, it ain't our problem. It will be if they've taken over Nova Corps. No Nova? No fine. No problem. You should probably tell someone. Yeah, tell it to your diary. Come on, down here. How do you know? I don't. I'm just putting distance between us and those whack jobs. Nice to see you listening for a change. You cannot see listening. Don't you start with me, muscles. You're still mostly in my good books. I am Groot. Who says I can't? So, you think? Yeah, I'll deal with the door. Hey! Whoa! Clark and Scott! Can nothing go easy? I have vanquished this Nova Corps traitor with my fists! Hey, Drax! Save some door for the rest of us! You guys want to go back to your weird chanting thing?
Caution! Watch the line! I need a little help! Don't make me ask for help! Oh, crap! I cannot penetrate it! are persistent! Yup! If we step them out, the rest is cake! Oh, prepare yourself! Just let me know, officer, to take you on your down! Then don't let him get that close! Watch my parking back while I deal with this door! You sure you can get it open? You gonna second-guess me every step of the way? I'm not! There, let's go! These doors have been barricaded. Means someone at least tried to resist. Bad lot of good it did them. We don't know that. There could still be others on the station. Or maybe those were the survivors who fled on the Hallows Hope. Were we in the same elevator? Those Nova barely got a shot off before they were gunned down by them glowy ones. I think Rocket's right. Don't patronize me. I wasn't. You're just trying to make nice, now that this whole thing has gone to scut. I was right about Hellbender's vault, and I was right about this Fracacta space station. What do you want me to say? You were right, Rocket's right, we should always listen to Rocket! <laughs> it's a start. <sighs> what would make Nova turn on Nova? Perhaps they were not acting of their own free will. Uh, they sure looked like they knew what they were doing. To me. All right, Hanger, here we come. What the flark was that docking number? R73-4PL. Are you serious? Always. You're my new favorite person, Muscles. No, not really. There she is. Come to Papa. 4PL. Done. All right. Bay is clear. Extending catwalks. And... Flark! What's up? The clamps won't release. Those whack jobs must have triggered a lockdown. Can you override it? Wouldn't be much of a lockdown if I could. I can hold her in position and get the engines warmed up, but you're gonna have to release those clamps manually. All right, release the clamps and don't die. All faithful, converge on the central hangar. Let's deal None with these rebels. Focus life. on the clamps, Peter. We'll try to keep them off you. One down. Are you making progress, Peter Quill?
Novacore nut job! How's it going in there, Rocket? I do not envy the rodents! I'm able to participate! We should set course for Contraxia. They bear our issues over a cold contestant. I don't hate it, but... We should report what we saw first, right? Because <sighs> that's our biggest problem, Quill. Come on, Groot, we got Scott to do. Rocket! What's with him? The Abomination is never happy. Rocket's got a point, though. Our comms are flarked, the trackers still count him down, and Corel could be anywhere in the universe. <sighs> it's not looking good. We are in the place between hard rocks. You mean a rock and a hard place? That is what I said. Hella knows we could use a night off. So, Contraxia? We should go to nowhere instead. Ah, another suitable location to partake in liberal libations. To report what we saw. Me and Cosmo go way back. He's chief of security. He'll make sure the right people know about the rock. And the tracker and fine? Rocket's got a guy in nowhere. We kill two birds with one stone. Okay. I'll set the coordinates. Maybe... talk to Rocket? Peter Quill, what does killing two birds with one stone signify? You mean solving two problems with a single solution. Ha! I knew it! There are no birds on nowhere. Hey, uh, guys? What's up? Nothing at all, Quill. Not a thing. Uh, something wrong with Groot? Nope. He's just, uh, defoliating. Seasonal thing. Come on, I know you're lying. You guys are planning something. What we do ain't none of your business. Leave us alone, Quill. The Nova Tracker on Peter's chair isn't looking good. Countdown is making me anxious. Three cycles is not a sufficient amount of time. Really hope we can have the thing. Re I suggest getting one that smells more pleasant. Assassin, you believe the events unfolding aboard the. So those coordinates? They're in your console. Got it. 
I need to clear my mind. Nowhere, here we come. Nowhere. Last space port on the edge of the known universe and home to the best black market deals you can find. And surprisingly good noodles. You ever wondered what kind of person found it was like, oh look! The severed head of a giant celestial being. Let's drill holes in it and live inside. They wanted the brain tissue. Very rare. Very valuable. The marketplace came after. Along with the noodles. You are certain this Cosmo is trustworthy, Peter Quill? Of course. He's chief of security. <laughs> and nowhere. And as such, probably deals with Nova Corps all the time. Trust me, he's gonna want to know about the rock. What are they doing back there? Shenanigans, likely. See you never, flark bags! A rocket and Groot, did they really leave? Yes. It looks like it. Do we know where they went? You're the last one who talked to them. Yeah, Rocket seemed pissed off. Try to behave while we're gone, okay? Maybe when we get back, I'll ask Groot to give you a bath. Fine, whatever. We'll talk to Cosmo and then we'll go out and have a good time. Like I said, we go way back. Plus, he's probably already heard about what's happening. All we do is confirm the rumor. Maybe he'll even give us a reward. I suspect the rodent and his tree companion will be drinking somewhere. Where'd he get the units to afford anything? I do not expect him to pay his tab. What about Rocket and Groot? What about them? They left. What am I supposed to do? Chase them down and beg them to come back? You could apologize. That's your advice? The apology does not need to be sincere. Yes, if we ever see him again. Big if, by the way. But if it happens, then maybe I might think about it. Anyway, once we let Cosmo know what's happening out there, we'll have more time to think about what to do with Rocket. If Rocket doesn't come back, we'll need a contingency plan for getting rid of the Nova Tracker. Why? We have not yet spent our ill-gotten gains. How do we find this Cosmo? We head to his tower on the far side of the market. That's where he keeps an eye on things. Hey there! I need to talk to Cosmo. He in his tower? Cosmo again. I guess I kind of miss the old boy. How exactly do you know him? Was he also a prisoner of the Chitauri? Nope, we met right here, back when I was in the Ravagers. Dishonorable killers and thieves. The Ravagers actually did some good during the war. Whatever bad stuff we all did is behind us. We're the good guys now. Right, heroes for hire. Except no one will hire us. Maybe Cosmo will have a fetch quest for us or something. He might even come out ahead on this. Keep an eye on your things. These coops are a bit hands-on, if you know what I mean. They have fortune tellers on Earth, Peter Quill. There are people who claim to be able to see the future, sure. I've encountered them on several planets. Strange that's one of the things most galactic cultures share. That and walking on two legs. 
I always imagined yeah. aliens would be more <laughs> alien. The soothsayers on Katath were unable to predict its demise. No one could predict what Thanos would do. Mad Titan will pay for everything that he has destroyed. She's gone, Drax. <laughs> Mantis, what are you? Do you still have those suicidal urges? What? No. Huh. And you thought joining a team would be bad for you. Hi. Sunlord, right? Is it Rockstar? It's Star Lord. Okay, that's right. I forget which version of you I've met. Did you do the thing yet? What is the thing she is referring to? No idea. Hi. I don't know if we've met yet. I'm... No. No, no, no. It's not... Oh, oh you poor... No, he's lying! I mean... Oh. By the quotations he wrote, the broken promise of all will be mended. Mantis, you okay? Oh, hey, Gamora! You look less depressed. Thanks. Don't worry, it's always weird the first time. Celestial Madonna! Ah, uh, fuck. Hi, guys. You should not be in this place. Actually, I'm exactly where I need to be. <laughs> I think. No. Yes, this is where I need to be. Or needed to be? Am needed, yes. Wait, why are you here? You cannot keep leaving the sanctuary. It's not safe. There are rumblings in the galaxy. <laughs> When aren't there rumblings in the galaxy? <laughs> Ugh, okay. We're gonna keep making that face. It was nice seeing you again, Gamora. Star guy. Green mini. Okay, bye. So, Gamora, you and Mantis seem close. We've met. Okay. You're being evasive, woman. Wait, woman? That's the nicest thing you've ever called me. I'm not gonna ask, but if you wanted to talk about it... <sighs> we met after I escaped from a failed job. I, I was in bad shape. I'd probably be dead if Mantis hadn't found me. She saved your life. Yep. End of story. That is not the end of the story. I know, big guy. Let's just not push it right now. Nothing of consequence. You're f <clears throat> I need to leave. Uh, something wrong? It's not your business, Peter Quill. Do not wait for me. Who's that? Drax! Watch it, Star Lord! Watch yourself, jerky red guy! Can you believe that? Talk to Cosmo alone. Jackpot 
I'd hate to win and then not show up on time to claim the prize. I'll pass. Astoria Symporium, private collection of Tanalir Tivan, the premier, premier, premier the exhibit of wonders in the galaxy. Most would hoard these treasures, but not Mr. Tivan. He is so, so, so generous. He wishes to share them with Welcome the common the people. Would you, 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 you like to take the tour? The greatest collection of gifts in the galaxy. No, thanks. I've seen enough strange things over the last few cycles. Oh, you have, have you? Well, then, have yourself a fine, fine, Welcome fine day. Welcome to the Emporium gift shop. The greatest collection of gifts in the galaxy. What is this place? You have stumbled into the wonderful Emporium's gift shop. Would you like to purchase a souvenir? We have some very unique items. Maybe. What kind of things do you sell? Replicas of very rare items. Figures and effigies from lost civilizations. Objets d'art, in other words. Figures? Like dolls? There's a member of my crew, a woman, who might like that kind of thing. A boorish person might call them dolls, but that is neither here nor there. Tell me more about this person. She, uh, also likes swords. Oh, not what does she like. What is she like? Oh, distant and tough. But I think maybe there might be some squishy bits in her somewhere. Ah, I believe I have the perfect item. What do you think? Would you like to make a purchase? It's just the right kind of creepy. She should love it. A magnificent choice. I presume you will forgo the pff, silk gift wrap. Yeah, this is fine as is. Very well. Enjoy your purchase. Good day.
got a lot of parts here. Oh, just about everything. <laughs> Mostly. Refurbished, of course. Hard to get new equipment since the war. Well... You looking for something particular? I wonder if you have something I could use to remove, uh... Nova Core Disabler. 7A12 series. 2G2, maybe? Ah, nope. That one's decommissioned. I know. I got something that should work no matter what. <laughs> and you're sure this will remove the disabler? It'll do exactly what it's supposed to. That's great. Thanks. games where I have no chance of winning, is it? Captain, Captain, Captain. Don't you know your onions, Captain? The good Bolshevik cleaned up the boardwalk. No grip, no grab, no cheats, no cons, no sir. So I can win. How about this, Captain? We play a friendly low-stakes game just to prove that I'm on the other What do you say, Captain? What do you say? Fine. I'm in. But don't try anything funny. Not me, Gavin. Not me. I run my game straight as an arrow. See? The ball's in this cup. Now, keep your eyes glued as it moves. All right, all right. Uh, the middle one. Well, I'll be. You got it, Captain. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Congratulations. You got a shot pair of peepers. Here's your winnings. See? My game's on the level and plumb true. A game of chance means you always have a chance to win. Yes, you're right. Sharp as attack, Captain. How about we play again? Maybe raise the stakes just a smidgen. Start shuffling and get ready to pay out. Oh, what confidence. That's what I like to see. Keep your eye on the cup with the ball. Here we go, Captain. The ball's in the middle. Oh, no. That's too bad, Captain. Looks like you lose. I was positive that's where the ball was. The eyes play tricks. Sometimes the mind can't keep up. Something tells me it's not my eyes playing tricks. A nasty bob, Captain. Thanks for the lettuce. Have yourself a fun day. Hey, wait. Come back here.
Cosmo's in the office. Bridge closed. Go away. Doesn't look closed. Sisu. Nowhere security. Super official. Go out away. Ali. Ali. I really need to see Cosmo. Cosmo not in tower. He out there, Star Lord. In Ali. Wait, how did you know my name? Go, or end up in Cosmo Prison. You choose. Cosmo! You in here? Cosmo! Sure. Not weird at all. Cosmo is definitely somewhere in this maze of rotting brain matter. Okay. Just gotta find Cosmo. Then I can deal with the team. If I can find them. Afraid, Peter Quill. I'm a brute and near invincible. I fear nothing. You, however, will perish in this maze. Cosmo? That you? Oh, I hate mazes. Especially stinking brain mazes. Okay, dude. Deep breath. Deep breath. Larkin Hume. Bet you end up inside one of them processing machines. Flark! I give myself a heart attack.
what we got here. Watch it, Star-Lord. And what's a filthy scut-stained Terran doing out here, Rawson? Hiding's what I think, Garrick. Aye. Terrans always be hiding. Cause everybody knows Terrans are scrawny. And good for eating. Uh, if you're into that. We might be into that. Except for the bounty. Hey, guys. Wouldn't happen to know where Cosmo's office is, would you? I get the distinct feeling that you're looking for someone of the Earth persuasion. <laughs> I get it, man. I get it. Us Earthers, we all look the same. It's not like you guys who very clearly look different. Get to the point, Terran. The point is, is I can help you find who you're actually looking for. Terrans do all look the same. Except this Terran's got a word on his back. Just like the bounty says. What's that word on your back say? The... Uh... I heard nowhere. Hmm. Well, maybe it says Star Lord. Either way, get him! We've been hired to clobber some Terran with words on his jacket. Uh, uh lots of people have jackets. Yeah, but you're the one the lady wanted. So hurry up and die! Wait, the lady ain't want him alive? Dead. <laughs> uh, lady H? Whatever Lady Hailbender's paying you, I'll double it. No dice! You don't cross Lady H. Uh, the triple! Uh, uh, I'll triple it! Yeah, now, Ross. to bring refreshments? Would it help if I said I was sorry? That's how we make our unit. Okay, okay, okay. Yep, that, yep, time out. <sighs> Woo! Heart is pumping. <laughs> Guys, it's very clear that we're evenly matched. Ha! Ah, no, we ain't. We're completely invincible. Oh, well, that sucks. But we're all professionals here, right? Right? Maybe we can work something out. Draw them apart before shooting, Peter! We need to split them up! Nice of you to show up, Gamora! It's the description! She's gonna pay for that kick!
Sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. Of course you would remember that, and then I ask you if you packed your lunch and you give me a blank stare. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about, something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. I knew you wouldn't wait. Do you know what a birthright is, Peter? It's something that's a part of you. Like your name. Before your father returned to space... Ugh, Mom... I know it sounds crazy and that you've never believed me, but... Something has changed. And now, more than ever, you need to trust me. And maybe this will help. Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. These belong to your father. I used to think he left these for our protection. But they might as well be paperweights. Still, if they're enough to convince you of who he really was, then maybe they're protection enough. Protection from what? Your father wasn't just from another planet, Peter. He was... He was important. And important men have enemies. What sort of enemies? I'm not sure exactly. His people were at war. And he knew that if he stayed with us, the war would follow him to Earth. So he made the hard choice. He gave up this life for the sake of his people. Your father left to protect us. And for 13 years it worked. But now something's coming. I know we're being watched. Mom, if you really wanted to play a game that bad, you could have just said so. I hope I'm wrong, Peter. I really do. But 
being the son of a king on any planet means that you are going to have a target on your back for the rest of your life. And you're plenty brave, but you're going to have to be smart too. Things may get messy. I'm going to let Kubrick out. I'll be right back. Oh, shit. <gasps> no! Oh! <laughs> 